first to Georgia Republican Congressman Tom Price on that unspent government dough that keeps piling up. Congressman, I was surprised to see just how much dough we're talking about. Isn't Why it amazing, you detail it? Yeah, it really is remarkable. And the American people know this. We've got a budget of $3.6 trillion. That's what we spend at the federal level. Uh, and we've identified $45 billion that is what's called rescission money. That's money that's already been appropriated uh, along with Senator Rubio. And it's just sitting in, in pots across the federal government in different agencies, energy and education and transportation and, and unused money. And, and what we ought to do is just, is just take that back and, and allow it to, to buy down part of the deficit. These are the kinds of, of common sense things, common ground issues that we ought to be working on instead of uh, doing the kinds of things that the president does, which is say we can't get it done. You know, what, what amazes me is that Washington would be having a situation of 45 billion in unspent money. Normally, when it gets in Washington's hot little hands, it's, it's gone uh, faster than a cannoli in mine. Having said that, can you go back and take money that's already been earmarked, pardon the, 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 the term, uh, from its intended use? Well, you, you, you can, but that's not what this is talking about. This is money that has been authorized and appropriated, and then the, either the project ends or it oh, came I in see, under cost. See, surprise, surprise. So this you're not is pulling the rug out from something. For some reason, no. it's money that never you know, got out the door for a variety of reasons. That's exactly right. And it's just sitting there. Now, uh, it, it's on paper, but, it, but that on paper makes it so that you can use that for deficit reduction. This is just one of, the mi one of the many, many ideas that will help us decrease spending here at the federal level so that we can get our budget in balance, so that we can get the economy back on track and creating jobs. You know, though, Congressman, of all of this is so simple. I didn't know about the $45 billion thing, which is more than half the money we're talking about to ease this so-called Armageddon that's on the way Friday. So why wasn't that offered as a backup plan when you guys were agreeing to this sequestration um, that the president came up with, Republicans obviously went along with, uh, when that was out there? Or did you just discover this? No, we, we actually offered this bill last year as well. Senator Rubio joined us uh, this year. This is the kind of money that Senator Coburn has been talking about for the past number of years. The, 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 he, he's also talking about duplication. But this is what's called rescission money, which, again, is money that's been appropriated, hasn't been spent, sitting out there. It's time to bring that home so that we can work on balancing the budget and getting this economy rolling. Congressman, thank you very, very much. Thanks, Neil. Take care.